I took a, I took a risk on the first one, 21-36 I believe. Uh, just six one hundred off of not even making the second round. Uh, but it paid off. I think I was a little bit more rested on the second one. I got faster on the second one. And the third one hurts a lot. But I think it helped that we got the extra break. I think we got like six minutes instead of three. Uh, so I was still able to start well and then just you know, hope for the best in, the, in those last meters. But yeah, felt good. Overall felt good. First time I ever done it. And looking forward to doing it again in Budapest. This was actually very similar to something that I did before the World Championships. We did a set of 1250s, uh, three minutes in long course. So, and that was something without warm down. So you did a long course 50 and then you walk back. That was your warm down. Uh, that hurt even more than this. So I, was, I guess I was kind of prepared for this. Uh, I think it's a little bit too early to talk about Olympics because we have like eight, nine, nine months to go, you know, and in those nine months, a lot of things can happen. Uh, so right now, I just take it one meter at a time. And short course Europeans is the last meet that I will have uh, the short course season. And then I start thinking about the Olympics. Uh, I wasn't even following this. Uh, I didn't realize I was the MVP, but it feels good, of course. But I'm thinking more about the team. Uh, hoping, really hoping we can make it to Las Vegas. You know, we're very close, uh, points-wise especially after winning the last two skins, skins races. Uh, I think on the home turf we'll have an advantage in Budapest and then we have one more meet where I mean a lot of things can go different ways so we'll see. But really hoping we can make it. Hey, do you love swim swim as much as I do? Do you want hours of endless practice footage, race video, and a guide to the best pancakeries in the country? Then subscribe to our YouTube channel below and follow us on social media at Swim Swam News on Twitter and Instagram. If we get a million followers, I might just eat a million pancakes. Only one way to find out.